Travis was a regular guy. He, uh, and we talked about regular things, sports, jazz, um, lots of music. We talked about lots of music and plays. Uh, I met him a long time ago up at the O'Neill in, um, in Connecticut. Lloyd Richards, uh, which was our link. Uh, Lloyd was the early director of most of August's plays, and Lloyd was my mentor. So I was a director up at the O'Neill, and that's where many of the new playwrights would come and bring the material, uh, or they were chosen, I should say that. August was among those, and so yeah, we spent a lot of time talking and discussing plays and how this play functions or that play functions or what this character means or doesn't mean. Um, so that was early on. And then throughout the many years, we, you know, we would run into each other or meet each other or usually about around work, around working relationships. Uh, when I did two trains running here, we invited August to, to do a seminar panel and he and his wife came, they saw two trains so we got to spend time with him here. Um, and he never forgot it. <laughs> he kept reminding me of it throughout our time together. Um, but he was a regular guy. He just was, it's, it's funny, because if you think about it, everybody expects that everything that August ever said was quotable. And quite frankly, it wasn't, you know, but, and, he loved to look at women. He loved music. He loved to talk. So he spent time talking about anything that comes, comes up. And politics was a great conversation, great conversation.